Yeah, the Jackson County Humane Society is fixed to house around 50 dogs, but the number they have is double that amount. And people continue to drop their dogs off at their gates, leaving the shelter no choice but to become a kill shelter. It's almost impossible to think about. These five puppies were dropped off at the Jackson County Humane Society in Newport last week. They all risk being put to sleep. It's not what we're built to do. It was tough, but Ann Hout with the shelter made a post on Facebook announcing that they have no choice but to become a kill shelter. That decision was made based on the fact that we have 108 dogs in a 50 dog kennel. From here on, until they can get some relief, all dogs dumped at the shelter will have the city pound come pick them up or be euthanized. It's going to be a heartbreak to have to do the euthanasia. And these seven pups were also dropped off. House says this issue ticked upwards during COVID-19 and inflation. The economy is not as user friendly as it was. And sadly enough, animals oftentimes are some of the first things to be ejected from the household budget. She hopes this can be temporary, but help is needed. Help looks like a foster, help looks like an adoption. Um, help looks like a transport to some place that offers to take dogs. But the number one way to help is to get your pet spayed and neutered. Every rescue in the world will tell you it is the bane of our existence. And Hout says for the cost of adoption, it's based on the pet's vet expenses. To make an appointment to see all of the dogs, give them a call. We'll have that number on our website or you can find it on their Facebook page. In studio, I'm Gary Burton Jr., KRK4 News.